my name is Adeline and I'm known as Adeline Me on TikTok. Alopecia is an autoimmune disease that causes your white blood cells to attack the hair follicles and when it attacks the hair follicles, right, it causes your hair to fall out. How it started was, it started as a little 20 cent coin and then as it goes on, right, it progressed to like a 50 cent, then become like $2 note, like $50 note, like wow, it gets bigger and bigger. I was really like shedding all over my room. I have to keep a broom and dustpan in my room because every morning or when I just move about, there's just hair everywhere. So it was pretty frustrating because the doctor couldn't tell me why. Like, I mean, we would expect when we go to the doctor, we would ask the doctor like, uh, why today I have fever? Then maybe the doctor would tell you, oh, cause yesterday you under the rain. <laughs> but this one, right, I'm losing my hair. And then I ask the doctor, why am I losing my hair? Is it because of my diet? Is it because of, you know, family genetics? The doctor was like, uh, we couldn't pinpoint what is the exact cause because for alopecia, for autoimmune diseases, um, there can be various factors like stress, etc. July in 2016 was Hari Raya. I shaved my head on Hari Raya actually. Uh, I remember that because it was a school holiday, like we don't have to go to school, right? And at that point, I was just left with about 5% of hair, like strands, literally like a bit of strands here and there. And I felt like this is it, I need to take control of it before it completely wipe out. So that's when I decided, I'm like, okay, let's do this, let's, let's shave. And my mom was the one that's shaving my hair. I mean, I was facing the front, she's at the back, but I can tell that she's crying when she's shaving my hair. And wow, I don't know, you know when people cry, they'll have the... That, that. And I can feel like the shaver was like trembling a bit. Lah. So I joined the SFVC when I was 18. I graduated from my basic training in April. And on the April 20, 28th of April was when I found out I got alopecia. And that was just so close to you know each other. And then the dates itself, I was so afraid that, oh no, I might have to leave the service. I won't be able to serve. I mean, I'm sick, right? So um, they actually sent me for a medical review to check if I'm healthy enough. And um, thank goodness, it is just a cosmetical effect. It doesn't affect my health in any way. I felt really depressed and scared, but it was also through the army that I gained back my confidence. Like, I was given opportunities to do engagement sessions, like go to schools, talk to the students about what uh, SAFVC is. Wearing that uniform sort of gave me a sense of confidence, and I was able to slowly not wear my jockey cap and just, you know, be confident. Uh. A lot of times that I felt like giving up, but I. I think I was, I'm very lucky to have a very good support system and the friends that I have made, you know, like I volunteer a lot, so I made a lot of friends through volunteering and even my army friends, you know, uh, they are always there to support me. So even at times when I feel, feel like giving up, I will always remind myself, like I'm so loved by everyone and I shouldn't you know, let them down. <laughs>